Hello and welcome to Amateur Money, your go-to channel for financial advice. In today's video, we'll be discussing a crucial topic for any job seeker out there, how to navigate the job market and find a high-paying career. Whether you're just starting out or looking to switch careers, we've got you covered. We've compiled all the tips, tricks, and strategies you need to succeed in the job market and land the job of your dreams. So, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more advice and tips. Without further ado, let's get started. Self-Assessment The first step to navigating the job market is to do a thorough self-assessment. This involves taking a close look at your skills, experience, education, and interests. Start by identifying your strengths and weaknesses. What are you good at, and what areas could use improvement? Think about what you enjoy doing and what activities come naturally to you. This can help you identify areas of interest that you may want to pursue in your career. It's also important to identify any gaps in your skills or experience and work to improve them. Consider taking online courses, attending workshops, or volunteering in your field to gain more experience and improve your skill set. Additionally, if you're not sure about your career goals, you may want to take career assessments or work with a career counselor to help identify your interests and values. Once you've identified your skills and interests, consider how they align with different job opportunities. Research different industries and job roles to determine which ones might be a good fit for you. Make a list of job titles that interest you and research the skills and qualifications needed for each position. This will help you identify any gaps in your skill set that you need to address and give you a clearer understanding of the job market. In addition to evaluating your skills and interests, consider your work style and preferences. Do you work best in a team or on your own? Do you prefer working in a fast-paced environment or a more laid-back one? Knowing your work style can help you identify jobs and work environments that are a good fit for you. By taking the time to do a thorough self-assessment, you can better target the right job opportunities and positions that fit your skill set, interests, and work style. This will increase your chances of finding a job that you enjoy and are successful in. Researching the job market. Once you've done a self-assessment, it's time to start researching the job market. This includes looking at job postings, analyzing trends, and understanding the demand for certain skills and industries. Use online job boards, industry reports, and networking events to gather information about the types of jobs that are available and the skills that are in high demand. It's important to research the companies you're interested in working for as well. Learn about their culture, mission, and values to determine if they align with your own. You can also research the salaries and benefits offered by these companies to better negotiate your job offer later on. Consider setting up informational interviews with people in your network or individuals in your desired field. This can help you gain insight into the industry and provide you with tips for applying and interviewing for jobs. Attend career fairs or networking events in your field to meet professionals and learn more about current hiring trends. Another way to research the job market is to explore alternative job opportunities. Consider freelancing or starting your own business if you're interested in entrepreneurship. You may also want to explore internships or apprenticeships to gain experience and test out different industries. By thoroughly researching the job market, you can gain a better understanding of the types of jobs and industries that are in demand, the qualifications needed for these positions, and the companies that align with your values and career goals. This will help you make informed decisions when applying for jobs and ultimately increase your chances of finding a fulfilling and high-paying career. Building your network Networking is a critical aspect of navigating the job market successfully. It is essential to make connections with people in your industry or field of interest. Building a professional network can provide you with valuable insights, advice, and job opportunities. To start building your network, consider attending industry events, joining professional organizations, and engaging with others on social media platforms. You can also connect with former colleagues or classmates and ask for referrals or recommendations. When building your network, remember that it's not just about making contacts but building relationships. Take the time to get to know people, learn about their career paths, and ask for advice. Consider setting up informational interviews with people in your network to learn more about their careers and gain insights on how to succeed in your own career. Be sure to maintain your professional relationships by following up with your network regularly. In addition to traditional networking methods, consider leveraging online resources to expand your network. 
LinkedIn is an excellent tool for building your professional network and finding job opportunities. You can also participate in online forums, webinars, and industry-specific groups to connect with like-minded professionals. When building your network, remember to give as well as receive. Be willing to help others and offer your own insights and advice. Networking is a two-way street, and building strong relationships can help you succeed in your career. In summary, building a strong professional network is a crucial aspect of navigating the job market successfully. It can provide you with valuable insights, advice, and job opportunities, and help you establish meaningful connections with other professionals in your industry. Tailoring your resume and cover letter Your resume and cover letter are often the first impression that employers have of you, so it's important to make them stand out. When applying for a job, it's essential to tailor your resume and cover letter to the specific job you are applying for. Start by carefully reading the job posting and making note of the required skills and qualifications. Then, take a close look at your own skills and experience and identify the ones that align with the job requirements. Highlight these skills and experiences in your resume and cover letter. Be sure to use keywords from the job posting in your resume and cover letter as well. This will help your application stand out to hiring managers and increase your chances of being selected for an interview. Remember. Employers often use Applicant Tracking Systems ATS, to screen resumes, so using the right keywords can help your resume get past the initial screening. Additionally, consider including any relevant achievements or accomplishments that demonstrate your qualifications for the position. Use bullet points to make your resume and cover letter easy to read and visually appealing. Be sure to proofread your application materials carefully for errors or typos, as they can make a negative impression on potential employers. It's also important to note that a cover letter allows you to showcase your personality and enthusiasm for the position. Use this opportunity to convey why you are interested in the job and what makes you a good fit for the company culture. Overall, tailoring your resume and cover letter to the job you are applying for is a crucial step in the job search process. It can help you stand out to potential employers and increase your chances of landing the job you want. Nailing the interview if you've made it to the interview stage, congratulations! Now it's time to prepare. Research the company and the position you've applied for to gain a deeper understanding of what they are looking for in a candidate. Review the job description and prepare responses to common interview questions. Practice answering questions out loud or with a friend to improve your confidence and articulation. In addition to researching the company and preparing for common interview questions, make sure to dress professionally and arrive on time. This shows that you are serious about the job and respect the interviewer's time. During the interview, make a good impression by being confident, enthusiastic, and knowledgeable about the job and the company. Listen carefully to the interviewer's questions and take the time to think before answering. Be sure to showcase your skills and experience during the interview and provide specific examples to back up your qualifications. Remember, you want to demonstrate to the interviewer that you're the best candidate for the job. It's important to remember that the interview is a two-way street. Use this opportunity to learn more about the company culture, job expectations, and the team you'll be working with. Don't be afraid to ask questions and show your interest in the company. Additionally, be sure to thank the interviewer for their time and follow up with a thank you note after the interview. This will demonstrate your professionalism and appreciation for the opportunity. In summary, to nail the interview, it's important to research the company and position, practice answering questions, dress professionally, and be confident and enthusiastic during the interview. Don't forget to listen carefully, showcase your skills and experience, ask questions, and follow up with a thank you note. By following these tips, you'll increase your chances of landing the job of your dreams. Negotiating Salary and Benefits Once you've landed a job offer, it's time to negotiate your salary and benefits. This can be a daunting task, but it's important to approach negotiations with confidence and preparation. The first step is to research the average salary for the position and location you're applying for. You can use online resources such as salary comparison websites or consult with professional organizations in your field. This will give you a better understanding of what you can realistically expect to earn. Next, consider your own qualifications and experience. Are there any specific skills or experiences that you bring to the table that could justify a higher salary? Make sure to communicate these points effectively during the negotiation process. When negotiating your salary, be realistic, 
but also be willing to advocate for yourself. Don't be afraid to ask for a higher salary if you believe that you deserve it. However, make sure that your salary request is reasonable and takes into account the employer's budget and the market value of the job. In addition to salary, consider other benefits that are important to you. These may include health insurance, retirement plans, vacation time, or flexible work arrangements. Be sure to ask about these benefits during the negotiation process and consider negotiating for them if they are not initially offered. Finally, be sure to approach negotiations in a collaborative and respectful manner. Remember that negotiations are a two-way street, and it's important to find a solution that works for both you and the employer. Be prepared to listen to the employer's needs and concerns and try to find a compromise that satisfies both parties. Negotiating your salary and benefits can be a stressful process, but with the right preparation and mindset, you can increase your chances of achieving a fair compensation package that meets your needs and values. Conclusion In conclusion, navigating the job market can be a challenging process, but by following the tips and strategies outlined in this video, you can increase your chances of finding a high-paying career that you love. Remember to start with a thorough self-assessment, research the job market, build your network, tailor your resume and cover letter, nail the interview, and negotiate your salary and benefits. Keep in mind that finding the right job takes time and effort, but with determination, persistence, and a positive attitude, you can achieve your career goals. We hope that this video has provided you with valuable insights and advice to help you succeed in your job search. Thank you for watching Amateur Money, and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more financial advice and tips.